expecting it because you can actually feel whether or not you have a problem with attacking these but it seems that they can still pretty much kill all of the enemy champions except these two so just ignore these two and just get some because that's what I'm missing in the build um, what the hell is Timo going for by the way has that been there all game or is he just trolling now that cannot be no 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 that I I probably <laughs> I either completely missed that or or he's just uh, he just uh, traded in all his items for uh, for giant belts but that's just stupid yeah I cannot rewind I want to see if they actually did that <laughs> Because this really, this puts the end to uh, to all the plans they have. So what they should be doing here, because now with with all of these skills, Evelyn should get a lot of magic penetration. She has no magic penetration except for the sorcerer's shoes, and as you can see, spell penetrations 15%, and uh, well, the Ramus, which is the problem. Ramus and Rumble are the problem. That's why they cannot push because these two, if they're in the in the way of um, yeah of getting a turret. Yeah, Ramus has 171 magic resist, and he takes 63% reduced damage. Well, minus the 15 you get from uh, the, I guess, offensive tree or something. Yeah, so from the masteries anyway, you are looking at something like 48%, and then you reduce that by the 29, which is uh, spell penetration red and um, uh, the sorcerer's shoes. You still have about, I don't know, 50% reduced damage, and same goes for this guy. And if you get the, uh, what's it called? So getting another kill there, 12 and 7 now. Uh, really stacking up the kills by now. Uh, you need to get this, the Void Staff, and this, the Abyssal Scepter. And with those two, you get an incredible magic resist reduction and then you, kill, you, then you can kill both of them easily. No problem. Because now you have a lot of AP. I mean, 20 stacks on this. Uh, here you have 80 ability power. Um, the this one gives you 60. And yeah, don't go for the crystal scepter. That's where you went wrong. You need to go for magic penetration. You need to kill these two tanks. And with especially with the abyssal scepter. So. Oh, this guy. Uh, it reduces the magic resist of enemy champions by 20, which means that if enemies are attacked by people from your team while you're near them, they always get reduced 20. The um, the 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 other one, oh, I forgot what it's called, Void Staff. The Void Staff actually gives you 40% magic penetration, but doesn't do anything for your teammates. So, Cartis, for example, and um, uh, Swain as well, and Timo, they all do magic damage as well, but they cannot profit from the fact that you have magic uh, penetration. They can profit from the Abyssal Scepter. So, with the Abyssal Scepter, uh, you get a lot more uh, resist, of course, but you can also just kill the tanks, and that is the problem. So, I didn't expect it to come this far so that you actually still had a chance of um, of killing them. But your problem is that you cannot kill Ramus and you cannot kill uh, Rumble. And, yeah. 
that kind of is your problem here. I mean, here, Rumble, he does die eventually, but it's going to take quite some time. But Ramus really isn't going to die. If you don't get the magic penetration. Same goes for Timo, by the way. Timo should have um, either the magic penetration and go for. Um, oh, what's it called? Come on. Oh, I'm so, I get so annoyed by these things. So, Timo should go for Blood Razor and um, attack damage. Oh, come on. The Brutalizer, because the Brutalizer gives you uh, 15 armor penetration, and that's not a lot, but it does help out quite a lot. And then, Last Whisper, which gives you 40% armor penetration. That's a percentage based on what they have as a magic penetration. So, if they have 150... Uh, armor like the oh what's he called the Ramus Ramus has about 150 armor you get 40% of that so that's uh, 60 yeah that's 60 magic penetration so his uh, uh, magic I know uh, his his armor reduces by 60 I don't know who he was trying to kill there, but but yeah, it's it's really that's I think the problem they've been having. The death fire grass, by the way, excellent uh, thing to uh, to have when people have so much uh, health that you cannot kill them anymore. But also does magic penetration. Oh, magic damage, so can profit from magic penetration. By the way, they make it uh, magic damage because if you don't, if you make it physical damage, uh, lifesteal would actually work. And that would suck. <laughs> That's why every character should have uh, magic resist, or should buy magic resist. Yeah, as you can see, Swain just dies too easily because he doesn't have any tank items. Well, now he's building, well, one of these and one of these, and he has some health here. But he, at least he has some magic penetration. But it's not a lot. It's 20 plus 20 here, so that's a total of 40. That's just not enough. And Timo, come on, dude! This is not funny. <laughs> it's it's really. If Timo had decent items, you could have won la uh, end game. It's as simple as that. But next time, if you're in a game like this and you have trouble killing the tanks, go for the heaviest items you can find in uh, magic penetration and armor penetration, because that is your problem. And especially magic penetration really works a lot. Uh, re really works wonders on your uh, your carries because well, magic damage does a lot, uh, or well, the AP carries are a lot better against champions than they are versus towers, and the reverse. The uh, AD carries are a lot better against towers than they are versus champions. So to kill the champions you want to have uh, the AP carries have magic penetration and a lot of it so get the void staff and the abyssal scepter and if you have more room uh, well the sorcerer's shoes are of course very good and then you have the one that Swain had here that's um, hunters guys or no haunting guys that's it so haunting guys, and if you have all of that, there is no way they can still live. You can kill them easily, especially with someone who's uh, had a lot of kills, like this Eve. And yeah, kick this Teemo off your team, because that was just trolling. There's 
he, he totally messed up the end game. You could have still won. I mean, it would have been tough, but you could see you were defending your base by just being there, by picking off the uh, Teemo, picking off the Warwick, and then the other three don't do enough damage to actually take the whole team out. And, well, you could have won. But yeah, kick Timo in the balls, because apparently you know him if you're on Skype with him. And um, yeah, next time go for magic penetration, armor penetration. For armor penetration the best thing is of course the last whisper. And then you have brutalizer and I think there's no more armor penetration in this game. So they should really build more items like that. Because it's really annoying to play against Ramus and not have any chance of actually killing him. So I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Chee chee.